Paradox Pokemon are really cool. It's a really fun concept. Pokemon from the past, the terrifying, aggressive looking beasts, and Pokemon from the future. Robots that have like floating hands, weird physics. Yeah, I'm talking about you. We also got two brand new Paradox Pokemon revealed very recently. So it felt like a really good time to go ahead and catching every single Paradox Pokemon shiny. For this first capture, I spent about six hours on stream with Encounter Power 2 Dark and Grass sandwiches and had no luck. So Chad talked me into trying out a shiny sandwich and I felt like I owed a little bit of a reward for hanging out with me. This is, look at me, listen to me. You're the captain now, all right? And so I was on my way. We had a route set up. We started at outpost number two and we'd make our way down the slope around and back and then around in this little cave the whole time i was spouting words of knowledge did they make it so you just couldn't shiny hunt these guys at some point the paradox pokemon did i miss that these guys like shiny locked or something crazy uh, suddenly i know that i caught two of them oh guys i feel like i shouldn't be excited because i know we're using a counter power three and shiny sandwiches but like he's right there Finally, look at that guy. Look at him. Hold on, can I get count? Can I get close? Look at you, look at you, ah, hello? Hey, how's it going? You're, what are you, you're real close. You're real, you're real, real close. What are you doing? That isn't, no, that's awful, hold on. Thank you, I am excited. Call me crazy, but I'm excited. I've wanted one of these. I love the blue. We spent five hours hunting it. And yes, we resorted resorted to a sandwich. But at the end of the day, you know, it, the effort was made. All right. I think, I think you get brownie points, right? Luxury ball. Critical capture. You love to see it. All right. So we got payback. Thrash, Giga Drain, and Sucker Punch. Uh, positive attack, negative special defense. What is that? Oh, we got we got a guess for Adamant. We got a guess for Brave. It's naughty. He's naughty. Look at him go. What are you doing back there? <laughs> Hold on. Come here. Get in my palm. Oh, he's running. He's running. He's running. He. <laughs> Look at that. Look at us. Aren't we cute? Oh yeah, look, scrub a dub dub. We're taking a bath. That feel better, bubs? That feel that's how I feel better, big guy. Don't open your mouth. You're gonna get you're gonna get suds in your mouth. There you go. Looking good. Looking good. You know what I hate about the camera in this game is that the you, the stick does nothing. You can't move around while in the camera. I don't know why that is, but goodness, that really is irritating. Next up was Screamtail. We started this at the beginning of stream number two for this hunt. Again, only encounter power two for Psychic, but we got really lucky with this one. I have been contemplating though, um, moving my upload for Mondays to be immediately after stream and make it a premiere so we can go from stream straight into the video and interact and watch it together. Is that it? <gasps> That's it! That's it! That is it! That is it! That is it! Oh, whoa! Hold on! That is it! <laughs> I didn't realize it was purplish too! It's inside me right now. Where did it go? Hello, beautiful. Actually, hold on. Can we? Let's take a selfie. Come here. Cheese. Beautiful. Shiny scream tail. Within 30 minutes of, of the stream starting. I don't even know how long we've been actually hunting. No, definitely not more than 20 minutes. Does this thing have anything to knock itself out? I offer you a trade. All right, you get in the luxury ball, and I will not KO you by accident. All right. 
Good. Thank you. Appreciate you. Paradox Pokemon Psychic Type. We gotta give it a nickname. We'll go with Bella. Look at her! She's sleeping. She's sleep floating. Can you get... Hold on, I wanna take pictures. Stop Stop getting inside me. Screamtail and the crew, bro. Scream, Screamtail? Scream, scream, Screamtail? You want... Do you mind? Can you turn around, please? This is the fortress from the video I posted the other day, by the way. He's just chilling. He's been in the party. I can show you how to catch your own shiny fortress in possibly less than 10 minutes if you want to check that video out. But now it's time to get on to everyone's favorite segment. It's cooking with Gyro. He's gonna make us a sandwich. Yeah. So we gotta put ham. All right. We put the ham on there, right? Follow along, Elmer. Put the ham. And you get the prosciutto, right? You put one prosciutto on with a pickle on top. And then here's the trick. You put the pickle underneath the next prosciutto. All right, you gotta make, you gotta layer this. And then you put down the prosciutto and then the bread comes in, you throw it away. You don't need it, get rid of it. You don't need it. Throw it to the, throw it to the wolves. Put the spike right through the middle pickle because that pickle is very important. You can't have it go anywhere, all right? You gotta make sure that stays absolutely right there in the middle. If it's glitching through the underneath the prosciutto that is actually on top of it, that's a good thing. That means it's um, seasoned well, all right? I decided for this hunt, I'd switch it up just a little bit and try the method given to us by Austin John Plays. If you guys want to know more about how this works, you can check out his video. Really easy to find. But basically, you make a sandwich for fighting types, and then you stand here at the entrance of Area Zero, and you knock out all of the groups of Metatite and Palmots, leaving only Slitherwings to spawn. I think the only time actually it's going to get used is like Nuzlocke. Nuzlocke uh, streams. I can definitely see Tristan making fun of me for losing a Pokemon. <laughs> uh, just some like generic anime faces I found online, like PNGs, that I. <gasps> there he is! Slitherwing's here! Slitherwing! Shiny Slitherwing on my screen! I, did, I almost didn't see it. I noticed the purple tail. All right, we gotta sneak up on him a little bit. See if we can get a picture. Hey, beautiful. Wow, aren't you gorgeous? Hello. Cheese. Beautiful. Now, I don't remember what this thing's moveset is. I don't remember if it can hurt itself, but I don't, I think it might have takedown or something like that. I'm a little bit nervous to smack it too much. Again, since I already have one of these, we're gonna throw the repeat ball. This is now our second shiny Slitherwing. And that is a critical capture. You love to see it. And here's what we're gonna do next. What do you wanna nickname this thing then, Emu? And do you wanna try to get your Violet copy out real quick and take this guy? We gotta do nature, we gotta do nature guesses. What do you, th what do you think? I think he's, I think he's gonna be modest. Positive spdf, negative defense. And he's gentle. He's gentle with no mark, but that's okay. No, Breloom. Breloom, get out of the way. What are you? <laughs> Breloom, Breloom's over here thinking he's the center of attention. What, what is wrong with you, man? What's wrong with you? You get so much screen time. He's dirty. He's a dirty boy. We gotta wash those wings. Oh, doesn't that feel better? Doesn't that feel so much better, Ippin? Oh, I'm pronouncing it wrong? I Is it Ippin? Can you get like a Google Translate pronunciation in the chat for me? Like, I, I don't know, man. Please, please stand by. Okay, I'm, all right. I don't know why this is important, but I'll, I'll do it. I forgot what Sabaku means. Hold on, let me look it up. I know it probably has something to do with it being a crocodile. It is intimidating. It's holding an X accuracy. Why is it holding an X accuracy? <laughs> so since I had already caught a Slitherwing, I didn't need a second one. I did trade it off to someone in chat who happened to be a good friend of mine, and they are still in the Discord call. Moving on to the next hunt, which is Great Tusks. This is another one I already have. We're gonna trade this one off too. But first, we've gotta find it. I feel like the man. This this hunt should be a relatively quick one. Rough wi- oh, never mind. It's not even based on the animal. I named the young Gusarai because rough, wild, violent, rude, coarse, harsh, fierce, heavy. Wild and angry, right? 
I always name my young goose Donald. Because you cannot tell me it does not look like Trump when it evolves. I have been work in an hour. I heard the I heard uh, on a TikTok the other day that nine times out of ten when the ice cream machine is apparently broken, it's just because they don't have enough people to worry about getting you ice cream at that moment. No, no. <laughs> what? No. Oh, geez, that idea. <laughs> Uh, yeah, sometimes, Napkin. It's broken because we're cleaning it. <gasps> shiny Don Pan. Or sh shiny uh, Great Tusks. Shiny Great Tusks. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get it, 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 I want pictures of it. I just saved. Get out of the way. Regular Don Fan, you're not the center of attention. Thank you. Goodness gracious. Well, it's, you were Napkin, so... And, and, and you can, you can pass it on. Yeah, if I win, I'll give it to Napkin. Well, I think well, Strizzy might be around. Shiny Great Tusk is here. That was so fast. That took us like 11 minutes. I think you were talking about the ice cream machine or something. It's good for a dollar. And yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! There's a shiny scream tail behind our shiny Great Tusk right now. <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> oh my goodness. Great Tusk, hold on. Can you please get in the ball? What is this, dude? Does he have takedown? I'm so nervous he's gonna like knock himself out right now. Oh my, the Jigglypuff walked too far away. I think it just despawned. I'm gonna go check, but I'm pretty sure it just despawned. If it didn't despawn, Catch it. Name it Ancient Puff. It did. It, it did. It despawned. It walked. It walked too far away. It despawned. Napkin, would you like a shiny great tusk? And if so, you get to pick his nickname. I cannot believe that in the background of our shiny encounter was a shiny Pokemon. <laughs> I cannot. I still like. I can't fathom the luck. <laughs> I I I I might I may or may not have gone into a little bit of a panic mode, seeing this shiny back there. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. We gotta give Don. We gotta give. Gotta give. Gotta give this guy a washing. Gotta give our great Tusk a washing. He's dirty. He just he just came straight out of the the mines, dude. He probably doesn't even know what a bath is. Look at him. Look at him. Look how much better that looks. And immediately falls asleep. We gotta do we gotta do nature guesses. I want I want to do nature guesses. I. I think, for some reason, the fact that he fell asleep so quickly twice at our picnic is telling me he might be relaxed. We have negative special defense, positive speed. That is naive. Oh, and he has a mark. Uncommon, sociable, shiny, and marked great tusk. Yeah, and the next one, the next one that I'm going to do is probably going to be the most difficult one, though. We're going to do Sandy Shocks next. Oh! Is that a shiny iron treads you sent back to me? Napkin with the shiny iron treads. Wow, dude. Thank you very much. I'm honestly so surprised this thing hasn't been shiny yet. I mean, maybe I, I think I've just been spoiled by this game, but like, it's not very often I have to use more than like two, maybe three sandwiches on a hunt. And like three, three is typically the high end. I think this is now sandwich number four or five. Is that? No. It just looks a little funky, but that's not it, is it? That's it! What? That's it? Why does it look so much more gold in here? I absolutely walked past that at least once, didn't I? I absolutely walked past it at least one time. Oh. My. Goodness. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it. It's so subtle. I The gif lied to me. I thought it was just a weird lighting thing. Legit. Like walking by, I, I didn't I genuinely thought, oh that's just that's just like a light a lighting bug. I'm upset. I'm upset because this this hunt probably would have ended ages ago. 
Oh my goodness. There's no... There, I definitely walked past it at least once. But we got it now. That's the important part, right? Sandy Shocks joins the team. And, and look, and that that looks fairly golden. It's, it's definitely a lighting thing. I think we're going to name it Goldie Socks. We'll do a nature check. A nature guess, rather. Oh, it's modest. That's actually probably pretty good, isn't it? Okay. Awesome. Modest Sandy Shocks. And look, in there, there it looks pretty golden. All right. It's picnic time with Sandy Shocks. Look at him. Already looking stunning. What are you doing? Where are you going? Why are you running? Give him a bath, because he's a dirty, dirty boy. And we rinse those suds away. You look great. That looked really fast because I edited it down. But I just want you guys to know that hunt took six hours. But it evens out because up next, we have Fluttermane. And the speed at which we found this Pokemon is absolutely unbelievable. The reflection off the... <gasps> no way, dude. No way, dude. We're 15 minutes into the stream. No way, dude. No one's even here yet. Shiny Fluttermane. But even other than that, why are they all on the floor? But Shiny Fluttermane. Ha 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 ha. Dude, that Fluttermane is off my screen. It's way up there, but it's fine. I can't really weaken it that well. That was so fast. That was so fast. Now we just gotta catch it. And we don't have, we don't have the ability to weaken it really. I'm kind of afraid a seed bomb from Braylon would be too much. Come on, Luxury Ball. Give me that crit cap. Yes! That's what I like to see. <laughs> Butter the Fluttermane. That's a, like, hold on. Look, we got, it's just ghost power too. And we still have 20 minutes left in our sandwich. Look at her, she's so beautiful. Look at those, I look, I just realized so many of my Pokemon here have massive flowing manes. I wonder if that says something about me. I may or may not have started the stream by singing uh, Tenacious D. Oh, how dare you. Can I give you a bath? You're dirty. Look at you. Oh. Mm. I thought you were talking to me for a second and I was very confused. <laughs> no, it's my flutter mane, dude. She got to wash her hair. Yo, Olivia, what's up? I'm doing pretty well. I'm doing pretty well. Uh, no luck today, but we just started about half an hour ago, so... We've still got time. Pikachu's a good one. Uh, Pikachu and um, Serena are my girlfriend's favorites. Very good choices. There's a Pokemon on the wall. Grass! Ah! Big yawn. You're welcome. Oh my, oh, 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 right there. Right in front of me. Look at it. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful, even better than I had imagined. Shiny, roaring moon. Come here, come here, come here right now. Shiny, roaring moon. I got real nervous there for a second when I, when I loaded back up and it wasn't around. Oh my goodness. Alright, I want to catch this thing in a luxury ball for sure. Crit cap? No? <clears throat> I don't make enough back from the content creation thing to warrant putting more into it than I already have. That's really what it is. Would you like to give Roaring Moon a nickname? Absolutely. I think I wanted to call this thing Shining Moon. And there they are. Our two new friends. Little Graybird, absolutely adorable. And Roaring Moon, looking magnificent. 
absolutely magnificent. Really beautiful. Really just fantastic Pokemon right there. <laughs> there he is. All right. It's bath time. We gotta wash those wings. You've been down in that cave for way too long, sir. Very nice. Boy, you look great. You look great now that you're nice and clean. And that that even concludes this hunt. Like, that's we're done. That's all of the Paradox Pokemon. And sadly, it's too many to fit in the party at once, but we have we now have Nathan, the Great Tusk, Sunspot, the the Sun Moth, I forget his name, Portabella, the Mushroom, Bella, the Screamtail, <laughs> Goldie Socks, <laughs> Sandy Shocks, or er, Butter, the Dinosaur Mischievous, and Shining Moon. It's beautiful. I'm so glad we got this done. I'm so glad I took this on. This was fun. Before you go, if you enjoyed this and you're new around here, please consider hitting that subscribe button. Currently, 98% of my viewer base is unsubscribed. That's a lot because we are still on our way to a thousand subscribers. Big milestone and I need your help. Go ahead and leave a comment down below telling me what your favorite shiny paradox Pokemon is. Also, if you can, try to work in the phrase geriatric into it because that'll tell me that you made it to the end of the video. <laughs> but with all that said and done, YouTube thinks you might like this video. I don't know. YouTube tends to know people pretty well, so maybe give it a shot. Alternatively, can I suggest this video? I recently got all three starter Pokemon shiny through Masuda Method here in Scarlet and Violet, and I think you might like it. But with that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye